Hi everybody, this is Shahrukh Khan, and you're watching me on uh, Bollywood Times with the one and only Devansh. My next guest is so precious that our nation can, you know, go to war over him. Uh, but you know, once you are kind of past his inner and outer charm, uh, what really is evident. is also the preciousness of uh, bawa singh ladies and gentlemen directly from mannat mr sharukh khan thank welcome to bollywood devansh. times thank you thank you devansh and thank you bollywood times <laughs> <laughs> okay you know what firstly uh, this is nostalgia i remember interviewing you right on this sofa yeah. during chennai express and what a wonderful interview we had yeah really uh, good time thank you uh, and uh, l- let me begin by firstly thanking you because you've inspired me by that one tweet 4 years ago i'm recalling uh and the youtube video that had the title i have um 99 problems uh palsy is just one <laughs> by mason zaid <laughs> and uh, tell me something how really uh, do you relate to uh, the character of anushka sharma afia uh, like you related to that video of mason <clears throat> also i think so you know uh, the whole film of devansh is based on the fact uh, that over the years i have realized which youngsters may not realize just now that there is nothing like perfection i i i've said that about acting also i've said it about arts um that you know all of us nowadays are striving ki hum kaise perfect dikhenge perfect kapde kaise honge perfect body kaise banayenge perfectly happy kaise honge perfectly rich kya perfection is an extreme uh, just like uh, imperfection or complete lack of any uh, form is uh, the other extreme reality always lies in between so i believe that uh, you know all of us have been given a body a mind a heart और यही है जो अब है उसके आगे कुछ नहीं मिलने वाला है वो कुछ बदलेगा नहीं प्लास्टिक सर्जरी करा लो बोटॉक्स करा लो थोड़ा बहुत ठीक ठाक करा लो लेकिन रहेगा बेसिकली वही और जिंदगी एक है और वो इतनी प्रेशर्स है दैट वी शुड नॉट वेस्ट टाइम इन ट्राइंग टू मेक आर सेल्स परफेक्ट दैट वी फर्गेट टू लिव लाइफ सो आई थिंक समबडी हु इज अफ्लिक्टेड विद सेबल पॉलिसी एंड अनुष्का इज प्लेइंग दैट द आइडिया इज शी इज जीनियस इन द फिल्म बट शी हैज नो मोट अ कंट्रोल Right. And uh, and and there is a lovely scene uh, uh, with his uh, with the father when he when, you know it's very touching. It's very what I like about Anand Rai is he doesn't underline stuff and puts music and all. It's just said. Uh, her father looks at her and says, "Ki yar, tu itni kamal ki ladki hai, flana hai ye ye, and wo aisa aisa." And she says, "Main thoda na Cleopatra hu." Ah. <laughs> and uh, and she knows that she's not Cleopatra. But what she does is way beyond. uh whatever her capability is so i i think uh, i really really associate myself uh, very deeply with all the characters anushka's also because uh, um i i don't think i'm a complete person i think i have lot of shortcomings but i think somewhere in the last 25 years i have not overcome them but i've been able to in spite of them uh, do well for myself and my family i'm obviously big thanks to the audience but some way they have also respected me for trying hard enough because i've never told them I'm the perfect guy. I've never told them I'm the perfect father. I've never told them I'm the perfect husband. Yeah. So they all respect me for the yeah. thing that yeah. you know, bichara kar raha hai koshish and it's uh, you just have to try. You're right. In fact, you know what? In your 26th year, sir, uh, what takes prominence? Uh is it the persistence to improve your craft or the success of your film? I I I really wish my films are successful because so many lives are attached to it. So I feel really sad. Two things make me very sad. One, the people who are attached now whoever works with me, I'm the senior most in the film in every which way. Um as number of years and age and stage uh um, and then I let down those 2 300 people if my film doesn't do well because their hopes up and on me. And they work very hard. And and they work very hard to make me look good. So I've not looked good enough. Uh, in a film second part is the audience who comes down to see the film and they are like expecting certain uh, hours of entertainment and i leave them unentertained uh, that's really saddening it's like letting down your own children so these two things bother me the success is not uh, success is actually just a measure of how many people enjoyed the film so i'm okay with that but um, like you said you know the more i've worked the more i've realized how less i know of acting and uh, now i'm really wishing you know that if i can have good 10 years 15 years of acting more maybe i'll be able to discover so many things mm. which i was unknowledgeable about so i think that really excites me now to find more about acting uh, over wow. the years and there's still a mystery to you tell me something uh, a quality of the producer gauri khan mr sharukh khan as a producer would like to adapt you know uh, the reason gauri produces all the films for red chilies is because uh, i am a spendthrift 
and I'm scared, <laughs> you know, when, and, and I'm, I'm also a middle class boy. So when the checks come and I look at this, I said, so much money has happened? He said, sir, you have to pay so much money. Now sign it. So I said, don't do this, I have done this wrong. So one, she signs all the checks. So uh, yeah. poor girl sits there and, and when a film is releasing hundreds of checks. Uh, that's one reason. The second is, the producer of a film has to love the film for the inputs of all the people that are coming in. Not love the film because he or she thinks he or she can make the great film. Um, so I think Gauri is the most apt producer because she loves the passion I have for films. She loves the passion my directors will have for the film, my co-actors will have mm -hmm. for the film. So she never appears on the set. I think this must be one of the few films where she's come very often uh, because my kids like coming, my daughter came, my younger son comes. Uh, but otherwise, she doesn't even come for the film. You know, a producer who can recognize that these guys are passionate about giving me a product which will be better than me because I don't uh, know that much knowledge mm -hmm. of filmmaking is the best producer. So I would like to have that knowledge that I can allow uh, the creators to have the freedom to go on a trip and uh, I, I can pay for it. <laughs> <laughs> so you are the flag bearer, uh, flag bearer, I have to say, because I'm talking about risks here. I'm talking about Bazigar, I'm talking about Anja, I'm talking about Dar, and then there's a Ravan. There's a fan and now there's a zero. A, what makes you take risks? And B, uh, uh, we need more people like you who can push the envelope, cinema envelope uh, and do things that are different at an age where you are called a superstar and then you're giving us a content that we haven't seen before. I, I, I think uh, it, it's difficult to be like this here. For me, uh, at a personal level, it is that for working so much, I can't get caught. Uh, we are already in a template of uh, a commercial film. I don't want to create another template and be the romantic hero or the patriotic hero or the action hero or the, you know, social hero, whichever. I've done all of them. Or, or the weird hero. I, I, I really think that people made me successful because I could do a Bazigar, a Kabhi Haan Kabhi Na, a Kuch Kuch Hota Hai, a Chak De, a Devda, a Ashoka, a Swades. You know, uh, people assume that I will try and be new. And many times those films haven't worked, some of them, but uh, at least the newness is what I think makes me the star. Not, not, not the oldness, not the sameness. Uh, and uh, I, I, I have to get excited in the morning. And then if you have people of belief like Anand and Himanshu who have seen, that they can take uh, the star to a new level. Mm. I have to go by the belief. I'm the medium for the director. I'm just the, the, the only intermediary between the audience and the director. If I can give wings to your vision, whereas I learn two things. One, as an actor. Second, uh, excitement. That this is something I've never done. Right. And hopefully we succeed. Yeah, but I, I, I fear sometimes that if I fail too often, maybe I'll just take a back seat because everybody has a limit to their bravery and courage and say, yaar, chodo abhi, yaar. Template wali picture kar lete hai. Uh, let's make some business and then yeah. uh, you know we'll see what we can do different next time. What is intensely profound about Babita Kumari and about Katrina Kaif? I think one Katrina personally, genuinely I love her because uh, she is uh, very finicky, very conscientious, very hardworking, and all that everyone knows. But uh, she has a lovely heart. I think uh, at the end of it all, when you meet Katrina at personal level, I spent a lot of time, not in this film actually, uh, but in London when you were doing Jab Tak Aja and we were uh, literally living together because, you know, we used to pack up uh, and come and be in each other's room and play games, scrabble, her family was there. It was lovely. We used mm. to be awake till 2-3 in the morning chatting and I got to know her. And what I realized about her is that she has the gentlest of hearts. Uh, she doesn't wish ill on anyone. She thinks too much. Uh, she gets confused with things too often. She's thinking of all the uh, right and wrongs. But in a certain sense, she reminds me of another of my best friends, Juhi Chabla. You know, they're yes. the good hearts, good hearts uh, in, in a beautiful body. So that's one. And in terms of Babita, I think that good heartedness, etc. All that, uh, obviously, when you're playing uh, um, a protagonist, all that is in the character. But what I like about Babita is that uh, she doesn't want credit for her goodness. And uh, even though she's emotionally incomplete, she may perhaps help that person without asking for any kind of uh, return. And uh, and then she's very strange in a way that, you know, you think she's talking very badly. How do I say? Babita is a better actor in real life in the film uh, than she's in the films that she's acting. <laughs> okay. That's a tongue twister. <laughs> okay, so uh, name two women who've helped you find purpose in life. Uh, I, I think it would be uh, my mother. Then yeah, I, I think it would be my wife, Gauri. Because uh, 
you know when i married her she was from a upper middle class house and i suddenly felt responsible that you know i need to fend for her and give her a good life because she has given up a whole family to be with me on a whim you know okay you know what's up i love you we all love you and uh, there is of course this is policy standard policy every time you come on the show i have to get you a surprise oh okay <laughs> okay so there's another surprise waiting thank you yeah and uh, ladies and gentlemen uh, this surprise if you seeing we are sitting in the library uh, of mr shahrukh khan and this is not nicked from here okay so this is what oh wow yeah superb this is here you know it's so strange i just about a month and a half back my daughter was uh, studying acting and all so i told her and my wife to sit down and watch this movie a taxi driver it's, yeah it's one of my favorite is favorite is uh, wanting to become an actor and learning acting kind of film and film making actually yeah lovely yeah. thank you so much you welcome sir thanks okay now i've got some questions uh, from the twitter galaxy and look look at the names they're so amazing right this called shaki pallavi <laughs> it's as if they own you sir okay what to do when you feel like zero in life just change your perspective i always tell people zero can be considered nothing or zero can be considered new start uh, zero can be considered a complete uh, circle of life so whenever i felt low whenever i felt wrong uh, after a film going wrong or whatever you know i think of it chalo now i've been given a chance to redo everything all over again i think i think failure is an opportunity to start all over again that's why i keep telling in our film uh, uh, zero se shuru karte hain shuru se shuru karte hain correct okay there's srk is rakesh i really want to meet your family <laughs> uh, if you met the real bawa singh what would you ask him i'd ask him ye kachhe banyan tum kahan se silwate ho <laughs> because i wear a lot of he wears a lot of it in the film okay and there's naresh soni who asks what was abram's reaction when he first saw bawa singh i was showing them husn parcham uh, and uh, the trailer was attached to it so i was showing it to my wife about 3 4 days back and he was sitting he came heard the song he looked at it and he saw the song then the trailer started and so oh, this is that film where you acting like me <laughs> so he, he thinks that? i'm acting like him he said that yeah yeah he said baba this is that film where you acting like me okay so so we are talking about uh, firstly congratulations on bard of blood thank you uh, the netflix uh, that series that we are waiting to preparing to watch it's amazing right your choices that you select a movie you do you produce a movie and then there is netflix i mean this genre is uh, is intense it's gritty it's it's uh, gruesome uh, and uh, and the book that you've adapted you think bard of blood can also be a a great film when you read a story Uh, different stories uh, i i can kind of sense what uh, uh, that story what platform it can lend itself to i think bard of blood lends itself to a lot of characterization also being explained uh, and a lot of twists and turns in a movie uh, you have only that much time you know so you cannot uh, do a fully character driven uh, if there are more than one character kind of so i i think it lends itself to at least parts now it, it that means it lends itself to a series it could mm. be on netflix it could be television it could have been a movie but in its uh, small parts it won't be uh, prequels and sequels so i think it lends itself more uh, to a series format because the series of events that happen in the film uh, in, in 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 the book well wow, okay now we're going to dedicate a little bit of segment uh, uh, called acting dum sharat sir if you would you know play the game okay. with me Okay, ladies and gentlemen, do not judge me here. I'm sitting with Mr. Shah Rukh Khan. Uh, I don't have to really, I don't have adjectives to describe this man. Genius. Uh, I call him a charmer, though. And uh, I'm going to act in front of him. Yeah, you can shut down the TV if you want, but you won't because it's Shah Rukh Khan. <laughs> Let's play, sir. You know the rules of Damshad Rads. You can't say. Uh, you'll you just can't say. say that. Yeah, just. Uh, so this is like a movie. Yeah, it's just movies, basically. Okay, okay, movies. okay, okay. Okay, and you can act. So. So I have to act. I, what I'll do is I'll do a heads up. You can act and I have to guess. Okay. All right. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Three words. First word. Zero. Second word. Ah. Oh, okay. Um. <laughs> Third word. Four. Ten. Fifteen. Twenty. Thirty. Mm. Zero dot thirty. Mm. <laughs> okay. Five would win. You lose yep. now. Okay. Thank you. Keep it down, please. Four. <laughs> Sorry, four words. <laughs> four words. Hindi, English. Mm-hmm. Hindi. Hindi. First word. Mm-hmm. Ha. 
एक एक फूल दो माली वेल डन टू वर्ड फर्स्ट वर्ड हिंदी फिल्म फर्स्ट वर्ड इज सेवन सॉरी मतलब हिंदी में सात 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 हिंदुस्तान ओ वाओ ओके दैट वॉज इजी माई टीम्स प्रिपेयर ओ जी आई कान डू दिस दिस इज अमेजिंग हिंदी लाइक हु आई एम मेरी फिल्म है ओके थ्री थ्री पार्ट नो फर्स्ट वर्ड फॉर तीन वर्ड सॉरी ओनली वन वर्ड हाँ हिस्से कर रहे हाँ हिस्से कर तीसरा हिस्सा Okay. Okay. Wait. Okay. The other half. Yeah. Statue. Hindi me chahiye na. Bhut. Puja. Kiski puja kar raha hai? Lakshmi ji ki, Ganesh ji ki, Ram ji ki. This is amazing. मतलब ये ये जो बुत है इस मुझे पूजा कौन से कौन से भगवान हैं ये हाँ नहीं भगवान हाँ मतलब क्या है इसको क्या बोलते हैं हम इसको मतलब ओके आई गिव आई गिव द हाफ वर्ड यू हैव टू गेट द फर्स्ट हाफ द सेकंड हाफ इस मूर्ति मेरी मेरी पिक्चर है जिसका नाम एंड से द मूर्ति से नहीं हाँ मेरी कौन सी फिल्म है यार नही मुझे मुझे करना है hmm. मैं करूंगा ना hmm. हाँ ये तो मेरे को तो बड़े आसान मिल रहे हैं यार फर्स्ट वर्ड एक फर्स्ट वर्ड इज एक कि एक एक दूजे के लिए hmm. नो दूसरा वर्ड दो एक दो इंग्लिश वन टू वन टू का फोर लवली चार वर्ड्स हिंदी पहला वर्ड दो और दो दो चश्मे एनक आंख दो आंखें बारह हाथ अब उसी इजी बट थ्री मूर्ति वर्ड्स द आइसिंग ऑन द केक अरे यार तुम इस ऐसे करते हो मुझे करो तुम लोग यार मूर्ति हाँ ओके सो लास्ट टाइम वी मेट ड्यूरिंग हैरी मेट सेज़ुअल एंड आई आस्ट यू द सॉंग्स दैट कैन ऑफ हेल्प यू प्र Uh, let me tell you, uh, zero songs are amazing. Hmm. Okay, and for some reason, even even a consumer like me or an am janta kind of get influenced by it. Like you want to wire in into uh, all the songs. Right now, there are just two songs that have released. But I think uh, isn't music now just not a part of it? But it's it's actually become you know a part of a cultural phenomena. I, I think uh, Hindi films are one of the Good things and maybe one of the not such good things is music because uh, having music in a film, in the way we do it normally, uh, formats your film. कि चार गाने होंगे, तीन गाने होंगे, एक romantic होगा, एक item होगा, एक dance वाला होगा, एक climax का होगा. You know, it's all sets up. Sometimes storytelling becomes difficult because of that. If you're trying to write a different story, sometimes it enhances a film where the film is more musty or romantic. So I think uh, Ajay Atul doing the music for this. Uh, Ishak Bazi and Mere Naam Tu are two good songs, diametrically different. Right. Um, so, uh, some uh, if you can have a song in a film which moves the story forward, uh, I think it becomes more interesting. Har baar nahi hota hai sir. मतलब हम कोशिश करते हैं लेकिन गाना कभी कभी सिर्फ गाना ही बच जाता है कि यार बस गाना है. अब जैसे हमारा आज तीसरा गाना रिलीज हुआ है उसने परचम. उसने परचम. Can be easily declared as an item song, like people say. But film के अंदर वो फिल्म में देख रहे हैं और वो जैसे आता है तो बड़ा interesting है. Uh, it's a story of the film. It's not just ki chalo, and it serves the purpose that people love to see Katrina dance. Yeah. So there is a dance number. Yeah, yeah. I remember initially picture me gana nahi tha, lekin uh, Bawa Katrina ki film dekhne jata hai, Babita ki film dekhne jata hai. To wahan pe humne chikni chameli rakha hota. Ab genuinely main bata raha hu, aisi baat chit karte karte main ek din Anand sir ke saath baitha tha. Unne kaha sir wo wo le lete hain Thugs ka gana, wo naya hoga, relevant hoga zyada. तो हमने कहा सर हम अपना ही कर लें अगर नहीं सर मुझे लग रहा है कोई फिल्म में से होना चाहिए ऐसी बातचीत चल रही थी एंड कटीना वसी रिंग इज डू वन एंड इट रियली केव अमाउट लाइक दैट बिकॉज वी डिड नॉट रियली नीड अ स्टोरी टेलिंग सॉन्ग बट पार्ट ऑफ द स्टोरी इज एट एम वॉचिंग अ सॉन्ग ऑफ अस एंड सेंग ले आपने तीनों खान यहीं खड़ा मेरी जान सो इट कुड हैव बी नाइ बट वी जस्ट फेल्ड आउट ऑफ लव 
वही सर यार कटीना के साथ काम कर रहे हैं बहुत दिनों बाद आनंद सर ने कहा मैंने आनंद को बोला मैं कहा सर आप करते भी नहीं हो कटीना जैसे हीरोइन के साथ काम तो आप जब करोगे तो एक गाना तो करो आप सो इट वाज वेरी न्यू फॉर हिम सो ही केम ऑन द सेट ही सेड सर ये मैंने बिल्कुल कभी ऐसा वाला तो नहीं किया एंड इट्स नॉट एन आइटम बिकॉज फॉर अस इन द फिल्म इट टेल्स अ स्टोरी द गाइज ऑफ गॉन एज अ मैटर ऑफ फैक्ट वो जब हॉल में जा रहा होता है तो बोलता है इस बार में तो दो दो आइटम है आ जाओ एन ई टेक्स द होल क्राउड इन द हॉल सो फॉर अस it it obviously it, it's still an item song but in the story it kind of moves the uh, the you know, generation yeah. Yeah, so yeah, yeah and the way he throws that topi at her ki le apne tino khan and also it, it it's really uh, actually it, uh, that's the first time we get to know he's such a big fan of babita kumari so it, it it's uh, very nicely placed so you can use songs smartly i also feel uh, what is going to play a big role is background music and with lyrics now like in hollywood you have uh, you know pop artists and international artists True. and they have songs so i think that also is a, a extremely important part and uh, music is part and parcel of film so it is the way mere naam to uh, gets operatic and gives you goosebumps it's like yeah, wow you know, in the in the movie that song uh, actually we don't have too many expressions of bawa uh, loving uh, uh, afia and uh, we were thinking at one time ki yaar ye do scene aur hone chahiye so we were we have the scenes written and we planning to shoot them and we were in america so we said india ke shoot karenge by then we had done the song and the song came after being edited and vfx and i remember out of the 12 people who saw it in the hotel room 10 of them said are wo scene ki zarurat nahi hai pyar ho gaya <laughs> so that song i'm i'm really really does take away yeah. a couple of scenes from the film and puts in a song and lets you the purpose of your storytelling get complete okay i think we are running out of time but you're going to blow a kiss to salman khan okay where here in the camera <laughs> <laughs> thank you so much thank you so much thank you very much thank you